How's it going everyone? Jerry here and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Black and White 3 Genesis playthrough. In the last episode, we made it to a new city. What the name of the city is, I don't remember. It's kind of sad because I actually played this game yesterday and I don't even remember where I left off. Flockacy Town. So that's where we are. We are in Flockacy and uh, I don't even know if we did exploring. I don't think we did any exploring. Let me actually, there we go. Uh, yeah, I don't believe we did any exploring. So let's go ahead and see just what Flockacy has to offer. Uh, this guy just keeps walking away from me. Welcome to our little town. It ain't much, but the ranch outside of the town delivers milk all over Unova. Good to know, buddy. Hello. I love fairy type Pokemon. They're so cute. Do you like fairy type Pokemon too? A pink bow. I don't have any fairy types with me though. But I do appreciate that. I'll make sure to keep that in mind. Thank you. I really appreciate that little pink bow. Hi there. Dark Pokemon? Corsola is cute, but I don't have it. Do you have a Corsola? Beldum! Ooh, that's actually a decent trade. I mean, you don't really get much because Corsola is not that good. But, uh... To the ranch. I want to get some milk. Where is this damn ranch that everyone keeps talking about? Some random trees. Okay. Uh, there's a Pokemon Center. We just came from there. All right. Oh, hello there. Mr. Alder isn't... Alder. Oh, man. I wanted to train with him. Alder, huh? Some garage. Okay. Route 20. Ooh, okay. So, I like the music that's playing right now in the background. Let's actually have Zorua up front. I want Zorua to get some training in. Haven't really trained with you, Zorua. To me, the battlefield is a place for learning. Oh, are all these going to be Alders, like, um, trainees? Or whatever you call it. Devin has an Eevee. Okay. Let's see what we can do here. Fate Attack is probably my best bet here. I'm pretty sure Eevee doesn't get any Fairy-type moves or Fighting-type moves for that matter. Nice. Okay. Alright, you can stop there. Thank you. That was a crit. Of course it was a crit. Faint attack. Alright, let's see how much this does. Do we get some decent damage here? Yeah, we do. Alright, so the Eevee goes down. 492 points of experience. I'll take it. Umbreon. Alright, so here's the plan. I'm going to stay out with Zarua. But I'm going to swap here. Send out Girder. Only because I want Zora. Ooh, son of a snitch. That was very smart on your end. He went for pursuit. Alright, so let's go out into you. And I'll go for the vital throw, actually. Night Slash. Alright, wasn't expecting to see Night Slash. Alright, did we get a knockout here, though? I know Umbi is very bulky. Yeah, I figured. Well, if you're gonna just keep attacking me with dark moves, I might as well just keep going for Vital Throw myself. Alright, so we get the knockout. And we're gonna get tons of experience for this, I'm pretty sure. There we go. Level 30. Not too sure what level you evolve. Alright, Devin. I've gotta analyze this defeat. Oh, here we go, boys! This is just what I wanted. Nice! Heck yeah, man. Just trying to learn Night Slash. Well, yeah, of course. Let's do it. Uh, Get rid of Scratch. We don't need that move. Nice. Heck yeah, man. Hang on. I want to, I want to analyze our brand new Pokemon here. That's a very strange cry. Uh, my ugly muck is actually blocking the uh, the stats, but attack is 79 and special attack is 83. Now, I don't think we have anything to give to you yet, Zorua. Sadly, we don't really have many uh, TMs to work with here, which kind of sucks. 
But uh, luckily, you do have some pretty good, uh, pretty good moves there in Night Slash, and um, oh, I gotta get some medicine, huh? Definitely gotta get some medicine. All right, wait, what's down here? Ooh, an item. Hard scale. There may be a move that that Zorua or Zoroark actually uh, can get now with a hard scale. Hi, hi, trainer. Please show me what kind of Pokemon you are training. Well, I do have this newly acquired Zoroark, if you'd like to see. Shauna. Eevee. Okay, so everyone around here is going to have evolutions. I'm assuming. Let's go for that Night Slash. Let's see how much damage we do here. Wow! Oh, that's probably going to knock us out. Oh, we live. All right, let's see what other Pokemon you have. So you have an Eevee. Next up is Flareon. So we do have the perfect Pokemon for you. All right, let's go out into Duat. And yeah, we'll go for the Water Pulse. I don't expect it to knock it out because Flareon does have some pretty high special defense. But yeah, figured it wasn't going to knock you out. And you do have some high attack, so. It pains me to think that the evolutions aren't better than what they should be. I feel like the evolution should be like peak. Because they, they aren't really good Pokemon. They're all awesome. Do I trying to learn Aqua Jet? You better believe I'm going to. Of course. Why wouldn't I? Um... I'm going to get rid of Bubble Beam, and the only reason is because I think Bubble Beam and Water Pulse do about the same amount of damage. And it's always nice having priority, so. Alright. Okay, so we got Twins there. Okay, so before I progress any further, I think the best course of action is to get some more medicine. I'm seeing a lot of these retro Pokemon. Alright, let's run from you. Very low level, though. Okay, so let's go back. Because I have to heal my Pokemon. And I wonder if we're going to be able to go to that ranch today. That'll be fun. Okay, so let's talk to you. Thanks, Nurse Joy. Healing my Pokemon. Alright, so we need some potions. And I don't think we need Pokeballs. But just for the sake of... I don't know what I'm going to encounter. I'm going to get some more. Just to be sir. Alright, let's see here. Alright, so I'll get some great balls. I'll get 10. Alright, and then... I'll get some super potion. I'll get 15 of these. There we go. I can't wait to get to the ranch because Moomoomoak is the best... Uh, bang for your buck. That and Lemonade, for those that don't know, if you guys play Pokemon, Lemonade are the best um, items to get to like heal your, your HP. Don't believe me, give it a shot. It, I, I tell no lies here. I tell no lies. Emoga? Yeah, right. Like I'm gonna use an Emoga. You must be kidding. Alright, so I have twins here. And then I have another guy. The two of us make an amazing combination. Let's battle. Somehow I doubt that. You guys are going to get defeated here by the one and only Jerry Oak. Alright, let's see what you got. So we're going to see eight different trainers here. Eight different trainers perhaps. Alright, so that one easily takes you out. Next up, we have Vaporeon. I don't really have anything to deal with Vaporeon. I'm going to actually send out Girder. This one's going to be a little tricky. Yeah, it's going to be a little tricky. Uh, I want to see how much Vital Throw does. Yeah, these evolutions are going to be a little tricky. 
Okay, I was gonna say that did a little too much. That doesn't do enough. Um, I should probably heal though, just to be sure. Let's go for a super potion here. All right. Mist. I forget what Mist does. Does it just make it harder to to hit? That raises your defense. Damn, that sucks. Oh! We get a crit back. Let's go. Hell yeah. Girder, you are the man! Our amazing combination. I'm sorry. Yeah, I wanted to go for the super potion just to make sure that um I didn't get knocked out there. Max potion. Gee, okay. It's a little overkill. Alright, so let's head back up there. Alright, let's see what we found. So we found a Vulpix and an Emolga. Krogunk. Okay. Not really a Pokemon I'm interested in using, but I'll keep in mind that you're here. Uh, let's see what's inside here. A Petra Berry. For the poison evolution that does not exist. There's a ranch. What can I find in the ranch? Let's see. Maybe a Buffalant? Swablu. Whose cry is that? I don't know. I feel like... Is that Natu's cry? I don't know. Flaffy? Because the cries of the newer Pokemon are made up of previous cries that have been altered. I feel like that was... That couldn't be Natus. Because Natus is like, doot doot. I don't know. I really don't know. Okay. Oh. Orenberry, I'll take it. Like, I'm pretty sure we're going to find a lot of ranch-esque Pokemon. Togetic. That's who it is. It just came to mind. Togetic. That's who it is. Oh, item. Can we get, like, the best TM for Zoroark? Can we get Flamethrower? That would be lit. No pun intended. X attack. Whoop de doo. Best item in the game. Alright, uh let's see here. Alright, so we have the ranch here. What is this right here? Hello. Our milk goes out all over Unova. Where do I buy it though? You want just one? I want six. Let me get some more. Do I have to keep going in and out? I can't... Come on. Can I not buy more than just six? Or is it only when I run out that I can get more? Flaffy? She needs lots of orange berries. Well, here. Here, take as many as you want, buddy. I don't have any more orange berries. Ah, oh, that sucks. Um, there are no more trees either. I'll make sure to come back if I ever get more orange berries. I'll try not to forget, because I'm pretty sure I'll get something neat. All right, so Flareon, Vaporeon, Umbreon. So we have Jolteon, Espeon, Sylveon, Leafeon, and Glaceon left. That's if they even have all of the evolutions. I hope this trainer here has the Espeon, because it would be pretty easy for Zorark to take care of. And nice to get the miss. Let's go for the Fanatec, because that never misses. 
All right, let's see what you have, buddy. Do we see an Espeon? Glaceon. All right, so we do have something for that. We have Girder here. That's an Aerodactyl Cry if I've ever heard one. Vital Throw. Okay, so you got some priority there. Oh, you lived. Okay. The way that the creator of this game modified the animations for every move is so awesome to see. Very, very well done. Tyrone. Good orders, he said. Alright, so we have another trainer there. Alright, so now we're left with just three. We have Espeon, Leafeon, and Jolteon. Sydney. What is this place called? If it has nothing to do with evolutions, I'm going to be pretty upset. Alright, so we get the critical hit. Nice. And next up we have... Leafeon. Alright, now I'm going to swap here because you do have the chance of getting x Scissor. That is... That's an interesting sprite, if I do say so myself. Uh, let's go for Vital Throw. Oh! Things just got a little serious. Yeah. And you have Sing, too. Dude, he just went for the SD. Swords Dance Giga Dream, boys. Let's go. Alright, that still did hurt a little bit. That's not going to do much, is it? Oh, it's going to knock it out, which is what I needed. Level 33. Any good new move? Any good new move? Rock Slide. Say less, bro. Say less. Excellent. Alright, Sydney was defeated. I've never seen a Pokemon like that. Well, meet my girder. Alright, so I have two trainers left. I'm going to assume you're the one with the Jolteon. And then the girl up there is the one with the Espeon. That's what I think. Darren, alright. Um, I'm daring you. To try and beat me. Is that funny? I think it is. <laughs> Alright, anyway. Alright, that's it, right? Twice. Perfect. Alright. So, was my prediction true? Are you the one with the Jolteon? Let's see here. Aha! I was right all along. Alright, let's go for the Night Slash here. Oh, you have Pin Missile! Son of a snitch! That was a crit too. Alright. You can just hit me twice, that's fine! That's it! Okay. Let's see how much this Night Slash does. It's enough to knock it out. I don't want to get hit with another Pin Missile. Let's go into Drillbur. Actually, that wasn't the best course of action. Nine. Eight. Oh yeah, no, you're right. Alright, you can stop now! I don't- I don't outspeed you. Alright, just hit me twice and we'll be fine. All right, you can stop now. Cool. All right, we're digging. We're digging away. We're digging away. Low kick. Nice. All right, so Jolteon goes down. 
And level 29. I don't know when we're gonna get an Excadrill. Rock Slide? Bro! What is it with Rock Slide? Uh, I'm gonna get rid of Slash only because when we do become an Excadrill, we'll have Stab on Metal Claw, so... It'll be nice for us to keep it. Oh. Oh, that's right. No, we're missing two more evolutions. We're missing Sylveon, too. Completely blanked on Sylveon. Oh, we don't have anything for Sylveon, do we? What if she has Sylveon, and then, like, the best of the best has Espeon, because she knows that Espeon's the best? I mean, everyone knows, right? Espeon's the best evolution. That's what I think, anyway. Ah, uh. oh, it's so good. Anyone that thinks that Espeon isn't the best evolution, I don't know what's wrong with you. Truly. Espeon is too good. Oh, man. All right, we got to do some healing here, boys. Don't worry, we came prepared. Okay, did some healing there. Alright, so I think Dua is going to have to be the Pokemon that deals with uh, Sylveon. I don't want to take any... Well, Zorak and Girder both don't want to take any Dazzling Gleams. If he doesn't have Dazzling Gleam. Here we go. I always give it my best when I'm around kids and Pokemon. Alright, are you like the Professor? Nursery aid Angie. Eevee. Here we go. Alright, Zoroar can easily handle the Eevee. The Sylveon's what I'm gonna have an issue with though. Just cause it's it, it hits hard. And it's very bulky. Gotta send that Dua. I mean, that's that's the only Pokemon we have. Aw, that's cute. Water Pulse. That's our only play. So we are six levels above. Um, and... Okay. Good damage. Good damage. Aw, oh, that's gonna suck. Reflect. Shoot. We'll go for a focus energy. Draining kiss. That's cute. I like that. Only because I want a higher chance of getting those crits. So that's why I went for the focus energy. And the Sylveon didn't go for the light screen like I thought it was going to. 22 points of damage each draining kiss. All right, let's see how much this does. So now we're confused? Yeah. So you have Draining Kiss. You don't have the other move. Um, just going to go for a full heal. Because we can live a Draining Kiss. We might actually be able to live another one. Yeah. Alright, so the Reflect fades. I'm gonna go for a Water Pulse here, predicting another Reflect. Alright, Draining Kiss. You know what? Actually, no, 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 no. Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go for Water Pulse, and then I'm gonna send out Drill Burr. And then go for a Metal Claw. Right? Oh, we get the confusion. Hit yourself. It's not even going to be needed. Dua the goat. Nursery aid Angie was defeated. Don't worry, Miss Angie. You're fine. All right. So what's over here? Verbank City. Ah. Alright guys, 
I've been recording for about 25 minutes. This video was honestly, I think, probably the best I've recorded in a while. Um, Verbing City is up next. If you guys enjoyed today's episode, I would greatly appreciate it. If you guys were to drop a like below, likes are very, very appreciated. And uh, next episode, looks like we're going to be tackling some Verbing City. So I hope you guys are excited for that. With that being said, though, whoa. With all of that being said, though, uh, I'm going to wrap it up here. Thank you all so much for watching. My name is Jerry. You guys are awesome. And I'll see you guys here next time.